they would have been very disappointed not to come away with Olympic gold and they've been able to swallow that bitter pill Forty-four, thirteen. Remember, Virtue and Moya. Here are Davis and White for the USA. Well, it was a characterable performance from these two who must have been sick to their boots, really, having put what it like an unbeatable performance, unbeatable sequence of performances in Vancouver, only to find out they were second best. I have to say, Chris, I didn't think they were at their best here today. I thought it was I, it was really, really good, actually. I, I thought they were really light across the ice. Love the sharpness from these two. It's a slightly different interpretation again. And uh, they're sticking their, their neck on the chopping block a little bit. But I, I really, really enjoyed it. I think technically they have such quality on every step. It's so precise and secure. And they sold it very, very well. Didn't seem to have... Perhaps the chemistry of the Canadians. The joy wasn't there, was it? But it, it could have almost been written for them, this, I felt. Lovely, lilting style, the flow through those toes, a natural knee bend through that inside three and onto the back outside edge. As you say, again, that lightness of touch. Yeah. Just extraordinary. And it's if you get the knees working right and you get that rhythm going, that's what creates that, that lightness and flow across the ice, which these two do just beautifully. And everything they do is, you know, to the max. Every extension is, you know, really thought out. So they got 41-47 in Vancouver. They need 44-13 or more. Not quite. 